Hey everyone, uh, I'm going to be teaching you Barry Ape by Nirvana. Alright, so before I start, tune down a half step. Alright, so this would be E flat or D sharp, same thing. So tune all your strings down a half step if you want to match up with the recording. Alright, so first power chord. Third fret, it's G flat because everything's tuned on half step, so you know this would be G and this would be G flat. This would be F and this would be E. You know, you get it. so it would be third fret, G flat power chord. I'm gonna go up to A flat. Alright, then back to G flat. And then up to A, which is on the 6th fret now. So it would be G flat, A flat, G flat, and A. 3rd, 5th, 3rd, 6th. Alright, so... You know, there is a G, a little bit of the G string added. So what you do is put your middle finger on the G string, half a step away from the root. Okay. You know, that's that's added sometimes. Not always, but you know, you hear it sometimes. So it'd be like. You know what I mean? It's there sometimes. Right, so after that, it goes on the G flat, then E, first fret. So after the E, you're gonna go up to B, then B flat, which is eighth fret, power chord, and then seventh, and then back to the. As it progresses, it's gonna start uh, going. So that's just. All right. So after that. It goes to 3rd fret on the A string, that's a B, and then it goes slap to the 6th fret on the A string, same, same thing, so all, all this is on the A string, so this would be a D power chord, then you're going to go up to the 10th fret, that's a G flat, so it would be... So, so far we got Alright, 
Alright, so after that, it goes back to the... Going. It, it, it instantly goes to you know and then it goes to it goes to the uh, B D and G flat So that's the whole song. Um, send me requests. Like my Facebook page. Follow me on Twitter. You know to know what's up and what's going on and what you know videos I'm doing and stuff like that. So till next time.